So they're mm. good? Yeah. Okay. You know, after the whole thing with Keith, I was diagnosed with PTSD. Rich person's PTSD, privileged person's PTSD. Wait, I do know what you're saying. This is why people hate the top 1%. I am not the top 1%. Neither am I. When people talk about the top 1% like it's a home, it drives me fucking crazy. You know who's actually in the top 1% are the assholes that run the companies that I prosecute and you reward. Top 10, top 20%, whatever it is. A segment of society that doesn't have to worry about basic things like food, clothing, shelter, transportation, or getting shot by the police. So we're not allowed to have problems? We're allowed to have them, but no one is interested in them, and I don't blame them. I'm not even interested. We're trite, trivial, tiresome, tone-deaf narcissists. Well, I never said I wasn't a tone-deaf narcissist. The optics are very bad. Nobody's looking. We should keep our shit to ourselves. We are keeping it to ourselves. Besides, it's human nature to find pain in any situation, however relatively fortunate. That doesn't make it listenable. <sighs> well, I'm sorry if my brand of pain is out of vogue, but it's all I got. But it would be so much more interesting and fantastic if we'd been fondled by priests or lost a leg but could still feel it or something. My theory about myself is that my Soma is sending me a Darwinian message telling me, hey, you're unfit to pass your DNA on to future generations, so you should just select out. Well, just keep doing what you're doing. I have so much to give. Not really. <gasps> Holy shit, Frank, what is that? I think it's a mountain lion. Could it be a jaguar? I don't know, I'm not a zookeeper. <gasps> It's too big for an ocelot or a bear cat, but too small for a panther, I think. What the fuck difference does it make what it is? It's a fucking predator cat. A cougar, maybe? Oh, Jesus Christ. I don't know what you're worried about. It's gonna go for me. Why? I saw a thing. They pick out the smallest of the herd. We're not a herd. We're wedding guests. I'm telling you, you're safe if you just run. You run. I'll stay here and fight. Oh, yeah, but I'm not a sprinter. I run for distance, so it, it gives me a certain clarity. Yes, all right. Here. You run. I'll stay here and fight. How about if we both run and nobody stays here and fights? Neither of us can outrun a cheetah. It's not a fucking cheetah. We're not in Africa. But they're also in Iran, I think it's sad. Oh, they won't even hear a scream. Oh, I hate those fucking people. On the plus side, you'll be ruining Keith's wedding. That's true. Unless they don't find us for weeks, and they're only in pieces, some of which were brought back to its lair. <laughs> last chance on the running. Come I can't believe you're the last human person I'm ever going to talk to. There might be EMTs. Yeah, but I might be a hemophiliac. Might be. Don't you know that already? Well, no, because you can get things as an adult, like adult-onset asthma. My friend Suzanne has that. <laughs> Now we run. Oh.